Pets. 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 Can you do like a like a epic edit to introduce this? Pets generate the most money out of anything on Roblox. If you go to Adopt Me, this is the obvious one. Uh, Adopt Me is, you know, pets. You can get a rare pet. You can get an ugly pet. What do you do with ugly pets? You bury them alive. Haha. <laughs> this is diamond lavender. So you just got this like, well, I don't know what this is. Because Adopt Me is structured like a casino, Um, you can spend like a lot of money very, very quickly. I've never gambled in real life, but I'm assuming it, it, it's like the same dread and terror that you feel in Adopt Me when you, when you open up an egg and it's not what you wanted it to be. Look at this person. Trade me if you have a neon kit. Trade me if you have a neon kit. Neon, 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 neon. Please, oh, please, oh, please, oh, please. Giving away epic neon. If you want to get some social interaction, go into a game and say that. I wouldn't be surprised if Adopt Me makes like 100 to 200 million dollars a year. That's not that's not a joke. I wouldn't be surprised. And most of that is off this. Look at this. Look how fast Mama's 50 dollars gets spent. Oh, wait. Then the hatch. Then you got to spend more. I forgot about that. All right. Anything unwanted? Yeah, you. <laughs> <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> I think it started with a uh, pet simulator, that one game. I think these guys started the whole pet craze on Roblox and then um and then I think Adopt Me followed after. Now everywhere you look there's pet games. Look at this pet tycoon. This is this wh what happened to his eyes. Someone caved out his eyes. It's only dark soulless darkness. It also looks like he's stuck in the doghouse. Today I'm gonna be playing every pet game. We're gonna see what pet game feels like a pet and which one feels like a skin, like an object of money. Look, I'm not a big stranger to gambling. I've I've never gambled IRL, but similarly, I open a lot of I Look, it's, you're supposed to be looking at the Pokemon card, not my big muscular arm. I open a lot of Pokemon cards. I mean a lot. I don't really expect anything, but this is worth like, I don't know, a few hundred bucks. These ones, which I should put, which I should take better care of probably. They're probably worth like, I don't know, 400, 500, I don't know. And I got them out of packs. So I opened up a lot of packs. So for like the, the, the few thousand dollars worth of like really good Pokemon cards that I can sell, you know, for, you know, a few grand. Um, I'm saying I have more than those, but I probably spent more than that. That, you know, so it's like a lot of times with gambling, you're not really profiting, and with Adopt Me, I mean, never really profiting. Look, this pet game is awesome. See this guy? He doesn't know how to move yet. Why can't I end his life? All right, this game is just like a tycoon, though. I want an actual pet game. I want to see if there is one pet game that isn't like a money grab and um and feels like an actual pet. Feed your pets. There's one thing about me, I am not feeding my pets. Speaking of money grab, you can go to flimflam.shop and you can get exactly what you expect. It's not an egg that pops out the least selling shirt. You can get whatever shirt you want. Even discounts, whoa. And you could use star code flamingo. You get nothing out of using star code flamingo, but I get money and that's great. What the? You just kind of destroy nature in this. Oh, you make food? No, I want, I want like a realistic pet game like if your pet doesn't die it's not realistic enough if your pet doesn't like slowly wither away and like it's really sad to watch it's not realistic enough catch all the cutest pets around become the richest zookeeper <laughs> oh my god that doesn't sound right catch cute pets not ugly pets and become rich but create a puppy mill pet swirled this guy looks like he's ready to take care of an animal dude i don't want a role play game follow me okay masked man with an axe Tell me where you find the stupid animals. What the? I'm in jail. I mean, rightfully so. That's a role play game, not a pet game. There is no pet game, dude. Pets don't mean anything in Roblox. It's just a, here, look at this. It's like when people wear like a Gucci t-shirt. It's like, look, $500. <laughs> look, legendary. This cost me many Robux. Pet trainer. That, that sounds like I'm going to be training my pets. It's Pokemon. It's a stupid Pokemon game, isn't it? I don't want Pokemon. I just want wholesome pets, dude. You guys ever played Nintendo Dogs? The game where you take care of dogs and that's all you do? Check out my Nintendo Dogs for the first time in 14 years. It's just bones. Oh, and they're monetizing it. Wow. Sorry I was gone so long. I had to, I had to get some milk. Man, this is a good game. See, like, you rub their little bellies. You, like, start screaming at them when they go... <laughs> Go to the bathroom inside the house. Free neon question mark? That's what I love. When you put a question mark, you don't actually have to, f to follow up on it. I could title any video. I got 
Um, I got hacked on Roblox question mark, <laughs> but I, if I put question mark, it's like I'm asking you the question A good example of this kind of clickbait is a uh, lanky box. They just kind of lie Look, can we get the rainbow ladybug pet free to Roblox adopt me question mark? And then they photoshop the pet that doesn't actually I don't even think it exists and then they just <laughs> they just don't do it <laughs> Will they play a Tower of L? Where's the, where's the ladybug? It just lies. <laughs> Dude, I need to start lying way more. I'll just make a video saying that I died. Question mark? There is this game called Rescue Me. I played this before. The concept of it is so like, oh, oh no, there's a there's a bird stuck in a trash can. So what you do to that trash can is you just you start sm. <laughs> <laughs> I like this one a lot because it's just funny in order to rescue an animal you have to you have to murder it I guess this one you can take care of I think adopt me you can take care of him too But it's just like I need a game where the focus is it fix it Freddy God a knife It just seems like way too much. All right. I'll buy the machete <laughs> get in here. Let's wash. Hey, this is kind of like What am I is that diarrhea stop all clean? See this one, you kind of do something. Oh, we had to band-aid him up because we have literally slashed him with a hammer. Let's heal. Those bugs are probably like festering around like a like a like a slash wound. All better. So this one kind of has like tasks you can do for it. Like I played this game a few months ago and they still haven't made it like any any different. It's still just the same old violence against animals. They need to be rescued from this game. Now there's another one, animal rescue. Use wand to save trapped animals. That sounds a little better. We're using magical powers to get animals. Use your wand to open bushes and rescue trapped animals. All right, so I'm gonna... Oh, I gotta like click and hold. It's just kind of like a simulator. All right. Stop. I don't want to trade. I'm not trying to be mean. This game's just not that. It's not like amazing. Like at least Rescue Me had. It was like a little bit funny. Let's go to the hot spring. 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 See, at least the pets and adopt like adopt me. They kind of like get, give you like little tasks to do. I can feed this thing. I think you can do tricks. Adopt me. It might actually be the best pet game. I actually didn't expect that. I thought there'd be like a pet game on this stupid website, like Nintendo Dogs or something. What does this mean on that wall over there? He doesn't want to sit. He really doesn't want to sit. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna write some Monday motivation on the wall. Some of the parts of Adopt Me are kind of weird though. How like, uh, I mean, it, it's pretty detailed. Like, look, all your pets, I feel sick. Let's go to the hospital. Like, you're, you can, uh, your pets can get like coronavirus. Like, that's great. Oh, I tripped on the sidewalk apparently. Let me just get up. I got legendary. It only cost me 50 bucks. Flamingo, that's a Dilophosaurus. You could dress up this thing, take off everything like its skin. You just see like all of its organs just fall out of it. Yeah, honestly, th like for how much Adopt Me like is like, uh, like a big old, like a big money, big money pile. It makes sense, I guess. Well guys, there is my review of pet games. Uh, I don't think there is one yet. Let me know what other things I should review. It's like stupid things I should review in the Roblox community.